Hello, my name is Ms. Rachel Corcho, and I will be teaching Latin 3 at Rolling Acres School beginning fall of 2019. In Latin 3, we'll be finishing up the more advanced sentence constructions of the Latin language and then move on to translations of longer text. These translations will come from authors such as Caesar, Cicero, Ovid, and St. Augustine, who is perhaps the greatest Latinist of the Church Fathers. These authors are not only important because they give us a glimpse into the Greco-Roman world, but also because they were very admired by the Church Fathers, not only for their beautiful Latin, but for their discussions on philosophy and beauty. And so the Church Fathers took words from these authors that were already so imbued with meaning, and they had to apply them to discussions of God, Christ, the Trinity. And so I think that's what so beautiful about studying Latin because like the philosophers of language I believe that learning a new language broadens our horizons for thought and it does shape the way we think and so I wanted to end by reading to you all this quote by G.K. Chesterton which says what is the good of words if they aren't important enough to quarrel over why do we choose one word more than another if there isn't any difference between them if you called a woman a chimpanzee instead of an angel wouldn't there be a quarrel about a word? If you're not going to argue about words, what are you going to argue about? Are you going to convey your meaning to me by moving your ears? The church and the heresies always used to fight about words because they are the only things worth fighting about. So I just really love that quote because it really shows how important words are since they are used to convey truth and the church fathers and the church councils always always were precise about the words they chose and the words that they were arguing about were Greek and Latin words because this is the language that the church has had for years. So I hope that you all will join me and I'm sure we have lots of fun and interesting discussions and I hope that you all can be excited with me about what's at stake with learning words and learning Latin and just growing closer to the church. I hope you all have a good summer and I hope to see you in the fall of 2019.